got Ags. He's got four points in natural order. So Monkey King walks in, zero armor. It does not matter that you have lifesteal if you do not have any armor because you're never going to win that trade. You're never going to be able to take that fight. OG just opened the map like they, they gave... Well, they got way too much net worth on Sumail. He had an excellent game. He's got a Magnus, so it got accelerated even faster. Monkey King was supposed to win his lane. He did okay. I don't think he got that many kills, if any. Probably one or two that I missed. The supports kind of tried to get some stuff done, but No-Tail shut down a lot of that. Like A lot of this comes down to their safe lane going well. Thompson winning mid more than he was supposed to by just a little bit. And then they just pressured the map so effectively. Got those some crucial kills. Thompson died a few times, but just didn't matter in the end. He basically created space with some pressure and everyone else played so perfect that OG just said, Aegis advantage, let's go. Pressure the racks and they did it. No, it's interesting because we discussed earlier how OG tend to be the agents of chaos. You're not quite sure what they're doing, but this time very clean, very, you know, just tempered in all of their movements, very disciplined. And I guess in some ways that is the agents of chaos, right? They yeah. did the unexpected and it clearly paid off because they are able to take this first game in the BU2 season series right now. So we are going to take a short break. When we come back, we will have game number two.